Hello everyone, I'm sure you guys are doing fine and uh, I haven't done a video for quite some time now as we have been through various stages of lockdown, stage 1, stage 2, stage 3, stage 4 and the great lockdown has been unlocking and the unlocking stages have begun. As the unlocking had started happening, people have started taking things easy so I felt it is very very important for me to share something very basic, as simple as basic as how to wear a mask. As I'm seeing in my OPDs, as well as in places in and around, people are taking things so easy and so, such a simple thing they are doing in such a callous and stupid way that I'm forced to tell them how not to wear a mask and how importantly to wear a mask. Because as you wear a mask, you are not just protecting yourself, you're also protecting the lives of people who you are coming across. So the first thing, this is a mask. This is a very simple mask. This is not an N95 mask. This is a simple surgical mask. In place of this, it could be a piece of cloth piece of, uh, or a homemade mask. This is how you wear a mask. Whenever you wear a mask, it should cover your nose and mouth, both of this. Now, many people, what they are doing is, they just wear it like this. Now, wearing a mask on your chin or like this is utterly nonsense. It's ridiculous. It's as good as not wearing a mask. So there is no point in wearing a mask like this. There is no point in wearing a mask like this also. The virus can easily enter through your nose. And if you have an infection, the virus can come out through your nose and infect people in and around you. So whenever you wear a mask, it should cover your nose and mouth. It should be this way and only this way. There is no other way of wearing a mask. If you really think you are going to make a difference if you're really serious then remember your mask should cover your face your nose and mouth forgive me your nose and mouth now what are the other things once you wear a mask get out of your home and are doing some business outside talking to people or <clears throat> buying something in a conversation with other people in your day-to-day -day activity do not have the impulse to touch your face time and again don't bring it down every time you speak to someone i see a lot of people actually they will be wearing a mask all proper the moment they come in front of you the moment they start talking to you they would come very near to you and bring it down like this sir this is this this is that i mean this is again another ridiculous kind of behavior this is the time your mask should cover your nose and mouth when you're talking to people, you're not disseminating infection from yourself to them. And at the same time, you're not exposing yourself. It's as simple as that. Why, why people do not realize this simple trick? How uh, anyone can explain that it's a matter of common sense. If you wear a mask like this, it's not going to protect you. It's not going to protect others from you also. So this is how you should wear a mask. And also don't have the impulse to touch your face or mask again and again. Preferably keep three to four sets of mask. Once you wear a mask, go out, come back. That mask is done for that day. Either you, oh, you can uh, wash it in uh, boiled water or keep it separately for three to four days in an enclosed environment, in, in an enclosed cover or envelope kind of thing and wear another mask for the next day. The same mask can be used on the third or fourth day. This is how simple it is. And of course, at the same time, must also follow the simple basic measures of social distancing. I mean, our voice can be audible to people who are at least six feet apart. You don't have the tendency to every time go near a person's face to speak to him. That is why many of the times patients and relatives do to us and uh, they do to each other also. You can stand at a certain kind of distance, at least 1.5 to 2 meters whenever you're talking to somebody you can speak a little louder you don't have to go to so near somebody's face and whisper them in the ears so remember this thing maintain that kind of distancing at least 1.5 to 2 feet between two people and third thing every time you touch something whether the button of a leaf or a door door handle table surface or any other thing any other item which you think is not sanitized you sanitize your hands wash your hands frequently so wear a mask properly wash your hands 
and maintain social distancing. With these three golden points, I want to wind up today's presentation. Stay safe, stay healthy. That's how we are going to beat Corona. Thank you very much.